Hey everybody, Kathy here with Pain Pouring by Kathleen Miller. How's everybody doing today? Um, thank you for joining us. And uh, guess what came from Amazon yesterday? Ah, my new stick. So look at my puppy pool, people. Oh my gosh, it's pristine. Do you I, really want to mess it up? No. <laughs> so what I'm doing is, I am doing a base today of two different greens to coincide with my green frog tape because that way you might not see the paint. Oh brother. I, I, uh... So I'm doing that with a bloom, but I didn't have the right color green in the golden fluid acrylics. So what I did was I took brilliant green Amsterdam paint and I took emerald green Amsterdam paint incorporated that with my color place ready to use white interior from walmart and that's going to be your base and that is my base today i may drizzle a little bit of this phalo blue and manganese and manganese golden fluid acrylic i took paint which is Amsterdam, and then the Golden Fluid, and I mixed both of those together to get the color that I wanted. My bloom colors today are Mediterranean Blue Pigment, Iridescent Green Yellow P by PBO, Metallic Cobalt Blue by Artist Loft, Pearl White by Arteza, French Lilac Pigment, Metallic Leaf Green by Artist Loft, Mango Mamba pigment, Key Lime pigment, and African Jade pigment. They are all Color Art Primary Element pigments. And for my recipe for these, please go to number 248, and it will uh, show you the recipe for my pigments and my colors. Yes, and I'll have a direct link to that recipe video in the description box and to pop up on the screen uh, to take you directly there. Okay, now I'm going to flood my canvas. Now, as you can see, Kathy mentioned she just recently redid her puppy pool, put all new puppy pads in. Uh, there is a video on how she sets up her pool and her spinner, and I'll have a direct link to that also in the description box and a pop-up on the screen. So it shows you how she... Uh, does the whole setup for her spinner. And I think you only clean it once every month or so. Oh, once every two years. <laughs> um, whenever it gets really, really hard. Uh, okay, all right. And Phil can tell you, he helped me move uh, the puppy pads that had all the paint. They are heavy. Yeah, a lot of paint does end up uh, in, in the pool. You wouldn't think it was that heavy, but it, it was heavy. So basically you're doing a blend of the two, greens. these two base colors, uh, the greens. Okay, all right. The brilliant green and the emerald green. I'm okay. not going to add any of the blue because I like this. All I right, actually you, like this. Okay. So you've decided against the blue. I'm not putting the blue in. Okay. Nope. I really like these two colors together. I think they're really, they really are. pretty. They are. They're very pretty. So, nope. Blue. Bye-bye. <laughs> See you next time, honey. Well, you're going to pick up blues and you're... Well, yeah, that's why I picked up the blue. Okay, come on. Let's get you popped here, baby. Kathy is an affiliate of Color Art Primary Elements and KS Resin and Arteza products also. And you can get some nice discounts uh, through the codes we have in our description box. Okay, so let's go on with our bloom. This is the Mediterranean Blue. Oh, wow. I love this color. That's a beautiful color. Oh, I got a drip on my good new <laughs> puppy pad. Oh no. Oh, 
Well, it doesn't last forever. As they say, nothing's forever. Okay, now we're on to our iridescent green yellow. Now, Kathy has a special video. Did we mention this already about your special video for blooms and yes. grizzles? Yes. <laughs> okay. See, my brain is. Uh, I already said it. Okay. Yes, we'll move on to red bubble. <laughs> That way you can tell them about red bubble, but this is metallic cobalt blue. Well, Kathy did mention red bubble, which is simply a site that she has a store where she, you can get her images on a wide variety of products. So I'll have a, a little link there and also a little preview video that you can watch to see what kind of products that uh, you can get Kathy's images on. We're on to the pearl white by Arteza. Okay. I added a little pizzazz in here with the French lilac to yeah. give it a little bit of a, a bling. Because lilacs and blues are really, really pretty together. Well, yeah, your, your theme today is sort of greens and blues, so Correct. it's good to have a couple Just colors. one. Well, you have a Metallic yellow Metallic leaf green. Yeah, I haven't uh, done too many greens. Okay, this is Mango Mamba. Mango Mamba. Yeah, uh, oh, just about a half hour ago. We're pretty late doing a, a video today. Um, we had, we had a, a bad storm, actually. <laughs> and my poor baby dog over there, she's just zonked out because she was shaking so bad. And she never shakes with storms, but I think... Because we don't get hardly any here. Well, this really was she's the first just, storm. Yeah, she's in... she was really, really afraid. I felt really bad for her. This is um, Key Lime. And my last color that I'm doing is African Jade. But yeah, I, it poured, it lightning, it thundered. It's like, whoa. Okay. And now it's beautiful. <laughs> yeah, this is beautiful now. Yeah, it's our, our basically our first significant rain in five months. Yeah, at least. Which is nice. All the, I heard all the trees going, ah, that feels so good. They were. I don't know how they survive. Although when uh, we, when Phil and I drive around, you can really see a lot of people's trees are really um, stressed. Stressed. Yeah. Because they should actually be trimmed and stuff. Well, here in Arizona where we live, you have to have a watering system, and it's a drip watering system that you set to water your trees. Your palm trees okay. and your bushes and so forth. I'm putting my black cell activator in here. And I'm gonna blow it with my little blow dryer and see what happens. Oh, abracadabra. Show me what you got, baby, here in this blow dryer. What about coming this way to this corner, Kathy? I'm going to blow it, Phil. Okay. I don't want well, to lose all my that. cells. Look at, oh, you see some of that, uh, what is that, purplish again? Oh, you can see a little bit of the uh, French, lilac? French lilac. Oh, yeah. Look at these cells. Yes, beautiful. Wow, this is amazing. Look at these yeah, you cells. Yeah, a really nice mixture of the blues and greens. Oh my gosh. Throughout the whole 
the loom. This is amazing. Very nice cells and then I like how that French lilac kind of tinges the edges. <laughs> it may be off. <laughs> well, I think it's going to be off. It. But it's beautiful right now. I'm not too sure you're close enough to the these corners with that, but that's, that's It's okay. going to get there. Okay. It'll get there. I got my eyes are itching, my nose is itching. Gotta do my abracadabra, really do my abracadabra now, because I think all these cells have come up. Oh, there's some yellow in there, Phil. Mm, yeah. There's that's, some yellow popping. Yeah, it's starting to peek through, too. Excellent. I can lean on here and I'm not getting full of paint. <laughs> this is so nice. But you know what, everybody? Oh. Take one final look because yeah. <laughs> it's going to be a mess. Here we go. Okay, so here we go. Gee, Phil, you know what? I'm not too sure we got to those edges. I knew you would call me on that, which is fine. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> oh. Kathy knows best. I should learn my lesson. You say it every time and I every know. time. I just think, you know what? You should know by now my magic comes to play and it's never not going to give you your edges. We and did We did lose the, uh, <laughs> the lilac. Yeah, we did. We really didn't need it though, because no, actually I was no. going for the uh, greens and the blues. That's and true. Just a tad of yellow came through here. Oh, here. Oh yeah, a little bit. We got there. a little bit. A little oh, bit we there. got a little there. Peeking through. Not much. It's trying. It's this trying. is really pretty. It is. This is really pretty. I don't even want to spin it again because I have so many beautiful cells. Oh, yeah, I don't think you need to. Spin I don't it think again. we need to because look at all the paint that came off. Mm-hmm. This is really pretty. I'm really excited about this. And you can see um, how the yellow is coming through around the edges now. It's starting to really pop up where it wasn't popping. That's true. You see all the that's yellow true. coming up now? Because it was just there. Yes, that's true. As it dries, you're going to see more of the greenish uh, the base. Two yeah. That you put down. Because, I mean, when you when you first do it, you don't see the base color, but as it dries, the base really, really comes through. I'm really pleased with this. This is really, yeah, really pretty. It's a nice bloom. It, it really is. It's beautiful. So, everybody, if you like it, give me a thumbs up and share it. Um, leave me a comment. Um, actually, I'm going to make a couple more colors that I want on a base with some of my uh, Amsterdam paints. And um, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to our channel. We'd love to have you. And if you are a subscriber, we love all of you. And until the next time, stay healthy, stay well, and we'll see you all later. See you later, alligators. Bye.